Just uh, one of the tombs of the Ming Dynasty. This building, does it remind you the building we saw in the Forbidden City? Mm -hmm. Because it was built during the same period, so the same architecture. It was a pity that in the Forbidden City we couldn't go into any of those buildings, but this building make it up. Yeah, because they were built at the same time, you see one, you see all. <laughs> and we were able to get into this building and see it. It's amazing to see how this building was, uh, was built. The, the way that Chinese people built ancient buildings is very... This is the tomb of Cheng Lin. Ooh, ooh. That is his statue. This is the layout of the this burial site for Chang Ling. He's buried somewhere underneath that burial mound at the back. We are in this building here right now. From the building we were in, this is the courtyard behind it on the way to the burial mound. From what the guide says is you can climb up to the top and look out the back, but you don't see much but a dirt mound because it's never been excav excavated to find out what's below it or to find the actual burial site of the emperor. So this is about as far as I'm going. <laughs> 